हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल दिस इज इसरो मैथमेटिक्स प्रोबेबिलिटी पार्ट सिक्स फ्रॉम 2006 टू 2016 क्वेश्चन इज ए एंड बी आर टू कैंडिडेट्स अपीयरिंग फॉर एन इंटरव्यू बाय ए कंपनी द प्रोबेबिलिटी दैट ए इज सिलेक्टेड इज 0.5 एंड द प्रोबेबिलिटी दैट बोथ ए एंड बी आर सिलेक्टेड इज एट मोस्ट जीरो The probability of B getting selected is how much? So in this question, probability of A selected is zero point five. Then probability of both A and B. A and B. Already I told it's a intersection B. So, P A intersection B equal to zero point three. We have to calculate probability of B getting selected. This is independent events. Both events are independent. So, for independent events, I already discussed in my previous video. A intersection B is probability of A into probability of B. So probability of A intersection B equal to probability of A into probability of B. Then probability of B equal to A intersection B is 0.3 divided by 0.5, so it's 0.6. From option C is our answer. This is probability of independent events. So this one we have to remember for independent events. Next, there are twenty locks and twenty matching keys. Maximum number of trials required to match all the locks is how much? Twenty locks and twenty matching keys. So let. Locks are one, two, three, four, like this, up to twenty. Keys are like this. For lock one, twenty keys are there. This is lock here key. So option is twenty. For lock two, nineteen keys are there. Option is nineteen. Here eighteen. Like this for twentieth, it's one. So total is one plus two plus like this eighteen plus nineteen plus twenty. This is our required number of trials. So. This is formula is if one plus two plus up to n formula is n into n plus one by two. Here n is twenty, so twenty into twenty plus one is twenty one by two. It's ten. So number of trials is. Two one zero. This is our answer. B is our answer. The probability that a teacher will give an unannounced test during any class is one by five. If a student is absent twice, then probability that misses at least one test is how much? That fellow misses at least one test. That probability we have to calculate. 
the required probability of missing at least one test is it's it can happen in two types at least one day so probability of missing test in only one day plus probability of missing test in both days this is our required probability so first we have to calculate probability of missing test in only one day this can be happen probability of happening test in one of the day who was absent into probability of not happening test on the other day when he was present so it's 1 by 5 into 1 minus 1 by 5 1 by 5 into 4 by 5 so it's 4 by 25 probability of missing test in only one day also can be happened in two ways if test will happen on first day and no test in second day or first day no test and second day test this can also happen so the above missing test on one day on one day can happen in two ways test on first day no test on second day or no test on first day and test on second day or means i told plus you have to do so this one already we calculated this value is here we calculated 4 by 25 probability of missing test in only one day so it's 4 by 25 or or is there so plus 4 by 25 so it will come 8 by 25 then we have to go for probability of missing test in both days probability of missing test on both days both is available day 1 miss and day 2 miss so we have to multiply one day missing is 1 by 5 into 1 by 5 so its value is 1 by 25 then our required probability this one probability of missing test at least one day or probability of missing at least one test sorry probability of missing at least one test is probability of missing test in only one day plus probability of miss, missing test in both days missing test only one day we calculated it's 8 by 25 plus probability of missing test in both days it's 1 by 25 so total is 9 by 25 so from option d is our answer Thank you friends this is end of probability thank you friends thank you for watching my video if you like my video then subscribe it and please share with your friends thank you